Hi, I want to demo the YouTube pairing feature. So YouTube allows you to uh, control the videos and searches that you want through your television using, say, a tablet or your phone. And that works through Wi-Fi. So I'm going to demo that feature here right now with my uh, tablet here, which is a uh, Nexus uh, 7 inch. And my television is a Vizio 401 i uh, razor series and um, i'm going to demo some of the limitations of it and first the, the way you do the pairing is um, you, you go on your tv where there's the youtube app and you go uh, there should be a feature called pair another device and when you pair another device you go to that url youtube.com slash pair and on your tablet so when, when I went to that on my tablet, um, I, I went to the browser and I punched that code in. And after that, what, what happens is you, you'll, get, you'll get a symbol here, up here um, in the corner of, of your YouTube app on your tablet. So I'm, I'm in the YouTube app on my tablet right now and I'm going to click on this and you'll see I'm actually connected right now so I'm going to say disconnect and when I disconnect I could view the videos on my tablet but once I actually have, once I actually activate a pairing you, you'll see I, I have that icon up there well, I'm going to say skip ad. You see I have that icon up there where my finger is. So I'm going to click that and it prompts me for uh, the television I want to connect to. And I set this up when, when, I, when I put that code in there. So, so you notice when I click connect, it's now going to try to play that, this video on the TV, which it actually did do. Now, if, if I scroll up to other videos I want to play, um, so I'm going to go to another video, and I'm going to click on it, and click play, and you, you should see a change on my screen. So now it's changing on the screen. So normally, this, this is a great feature because I, I am totally controlling what I'm displaying on my screen. And this is different from what DLNA is. DLNA is file share, whereas this, I'm, I'm actually controlling what I see on my screen using my tablet um, and the YouTube app on my tablet working with, in conjunction with the YouTube app on my television. So this is what YouTube pairing is. Now, um, you see how it froze there. Now this, this is the limitation of uh, my television. It doesn't work well with the YouTube pairing because I think the reputation with my television is that the Wi-Fi receptor or receiver is actually very poor. Um, so I have a very jittery um, kind of uh, interaction here with YouTube pairing when I actually do do, um, the, when I actually do use this feature. So this is basically what YouTube pairing is. Um, but let me try to get a good... So you'll see once again, it is all about this icon here after you do YouTube pairing. Now let, let me go to... Let, let me take some time here and go to that web page. So you can see uh, how, how exactly I actually signed up through the web. And again... Um, let me go back to that screen where I do the pairing. So this is the pairing screen that gives me the code and you'll see that code there. And um, if I go to that website
So just give me one second here when I navigate to YouTube slash pair. So I've, I've, I'm now going to that YouTube pairing website. And you'll see that that's what happens. Uh, I just opened up a browser on my tablet and I type that in and it'll say add. So when I click on add, I, I have to enter my code in here. So if I enter my code in here, after that is when I actually get the extra uh, icon when I'm playing the video on my tablet or on a phone. Um, so, but um, there you go. That is the demo of uh, YouTube pairing. And uh, thank you for watching.